What's up, fan tackler family? I'm back with another video today. I'm just telling you a story about um, open interview on Craigslist. Open interview on Craigslist. Uh, about two weeks ago, I was real stressed out going through some hard times through working for Peep Ready, which is the label pool I work for here in Florida. And um, my hour was real low for two weeks. I'm asking everybody what's going on. Nobody could tell me nothing. You know, and um, when it came out to the second week, I was getting real frustrated. I finally realized that I got to go to the bank and touch money that I got saved in order to make up-to-date child support payment. Something I feel I shouldn't have to do. So I got mad at the world. I got mad. I'm about to hot about it. So uh, every day that I got off that P. Red didn't have no work, I took the time to go to the library and do online applications. I'm talking about Craigslist, Indeed.com, Simply Hire, um, Snagger Jobs, Craigslist, going to all these websites. Everything, every job that I seen that I was interested in, I applied for it. And um, I came across an ad for a restaurant called Krispy Kreme Donuts. Looked real easy. The benefits looked good. And the, um, and the, the hourly pay looked good as, good as well. So I wrote down the times for the open interview. And put it aside, like my next day off or the next day that people ready is slow, I'm gonna take the time to go to that open interview and see what's what is what. So um then the next day, two days later, I go and people ready, same results. No work. This is something that's unusual for a daily work for daily pay place to have no work during a work week. I can understand on the weekend. Nothing but repeat, but when it comes to Monday through Friday, nothing but repeats, that becomes an issue. So, and see me getting mad going off on the dispatcher, I tell myself I'm going to that open interview today. I've never been to an open interview, I don't know what to expect, but I'm going to go get this experience and go to my first open interview. So, 8, 9 in the morning, I head over there. Show up for the open interview. Me and the guy got to talking and everything, you know, when it's playing. He told me a little story, you know. Um, he told at first he told me that uh, he was on the hiring for second and third shift, which is three p.m. to eleven, and eleven p.m. to seven a.m., which is two shifts I can't work because I have a night job already. So time goes on, you know. So I'm on the look for day shift, and he tells me, well, you know, um, let me talk to the owner because another guy that he hired. I already did two no call no shows, so let him talk to the, the owner and get the approval to fire him. And then if he if he get the approval to fire him, I got the job. So I agree, I'm cool with it. You know, we talk a little bit longer and everything. And then I go home, and um, I think that that Saturday, that Saturday, the same week, um, I'm on my lunch break. I check my phone. I got a voicemail for the man, so I get excited. I write his number down, hang up, call him right away. He told me what was what, you know, um, get black pants, get blue pants, slip resistant shoes, and come in with a t shirt on to do your high paperwork. I said, sure, okay, I'll be there mon I'll be there Monday morning. You know? Short Monday morning. It took a while, it took like a good hour wait, two, three hour wait, because he was running late. Get in, get all that high paperwork done, watch all the little safety videos, all the little sexual harassment, you know all the the um the hiring process paperwork got all that done. Got the job. Got a start date for Tuesday. You know, um, um he gave me this guy shift that had been there twenty five years, which is seven to three weekends off. So Monday to Friday, seven AM to three PM. Cool, I'm cool with it, you know. So uh that's how I got hired at Krispy Kreme. You know what I mean? That's my first time ever getting hired on a job through Craigslist. You know, I was applied in the past and led to, we're going to call you for an interview, but the interview never went nowhere. I was a little nervous about going because you think open interview, the first thing that comes to your mind is it's going to be a thousand people and it's going to be like 20 people in there for the same position. So now the job can pick and choose who they want to hire out of 20 people. You know what I'm saying? So that's the reason I never... I never went to an open interview in the past because of that, you know. But this time, I walked away with the job. I'm pretty excited. I walked away with the job. I got two weeks in already. So uh, I don't want to share that story with y'all. And um, for a shout-out, in my last Sunday October shout-out video, 
Tell me in the comments, have you ever been hired or how do you what's your share one of your experiences about open interview that you had in your in your in your life? And I would give you a shout out in my last Sunday October shout out video. Also, if you like this this story time of uh um getting hired through open interview through Craigslist, then take the time to subscribe, like, comment, and share the video. And most importantly, if you don't like this video, then take the time to watch the other videos on the screen. And if you like them video, remember to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Go ahead, right. you put your full name and phone number on top there. Right. How are you doing today? I'm doing well, thanks. How about yourself? I can't complain. I just seen it on, on Craig yesterday and made it my business to come up here and... What's it? Oh, hold on. Yeah, we've been uh, trying to get some ships and stuff covered, man. Huh? Trying to get some uh, spots filled. So, and Craig knows I think we're doing a snag a job, too. Mm -hmm. But what position is open for the morning, sir? Morning? None. None? No. Oh, man. We just filled it. Ooh. We do have uh, 3 to 11 and 11 to 7. See, the thing, I work at Arby's at night. Like, I'll okay. be there from 5 to midnight at the latest. Uh, Can I just keep checking back then in case anything opened up? Yeah. All right, yeah. I just keep checking back then. Oh, man. Still, yeah. still fill this out or? Uh, no, there. I'll, I'll hold on to it, mm -hmm. and it just, uh, if anything, your availability, for example, if we have anything on that shift, uh -huh. then, uh, I'll give you a call. All right. I'll give you a call first. Okay. Uh, just like even, you might hear from me soon, because I had a production guy that didn't show up today. For real? On the shift. Well, I mean, so, so you need somebody uh, I'm willing to start the next day, you know what I mean? I'm always on time. Um, You're willing to work production? Willing to work production. Yeah, I work at Arby's at night. I've been there since I started there March 1st. Yeah. You know what I mean? And I usually work at Peep Ready, but like the last couple of weeks, things have been tremendous slow. The money that I got saved to better myself, I'm dipping into that to pay child yeah. support. That's a, that's an issue. I get you. you know, I'm, yeah, trying to, yeah. I'm trying to get out there for good. You know what I mean? I get that. <laughs> All right. Um, but I can be on time. I already know what bus to bring down here from the bus station. I know it's time to be there to get it to come this way. You know what I mean? Alright, well, I know the show started if I do decide to replace mm -hmm. him and that spot does open, then you're doing on the show. Punctuality mm -hmm. is the biggest support, the most important thing. Um, you need to, if you take a bus, you need to make sure you're on time. I can do that you know, no problem. If you have to catch a bus early, get here early, then that's what you have to do. Early's on time, on time's late. Mm -hmm. The way I've always looked at it, any food service, any job really. Okay, um, exactly, that's how it should be. Call outs. Not showing up. That's our biggest issue right now. That's why I like this kid. Like, mm -hmm. I can be here early. I can be here at 6, 6.30 at the earliest. At, at the early, you know what I mean? I'm willing to work. Shift I'm 7 o'clock, so 6, 6.30. Mm -hmm. That works. All right. All right, let me talk to my, uh, I'll talk to my owner. Okay. And uh, see what he wants to do as far as that goes, because this guy did this last week, too, so. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. He might have just lost his lives. Uh, <laughs> kitty cat lives, nine lives. Alright. So, uh, I'll go over it and then uh, you'll hear back from me if we have the opening. Okay. Alright, man. Alright, thank you, man. All Appreciate right, you. Thank you, man.